Okay, now let's see some examples, okay? This is going to be page two, and let's see some examples. Well, let's suppose we just have minus three, minus eight. Why does that mean, okay? Let's just take the groups. This is a group. It might seem even silly for you that um, we're just uh, presenting them as groups, but we're going to see why I'm concerned about that. And let's even call right with different shapes and even colors. So this is one group and this is another group. Well, some people say that when you, when you are dealing with negative numbers, we can switch places because it, uh, things are changed. Well, it is true and it's not at the same time. Why? Because look, we can change. We can change whatever we want as long as we bring all the information along with that number, okay? Uh, and this is the same as minus eight, minus three, okay? Or just the way it was, but now with color, minus three, minus eight. Okay, Let, let's say another example in here. <clears throat> I'm going to I'm going to write everything on, on with colors. Okay, now uh, maybe five minus two. Some people say, well, when we're dealing with negative numbers like this, okay, we can switch places. We can only switch when it's positive, right? Like uh, five plus two and two plus five is the same. But five minus two, we can switch. We can switch, but you have to be careful. Okay, we have to understand that we cannot switch the two. We have to switch this entire group. So this, there is no problem when we just say that this it is the same as minus two plus five. There is no problem stating this, okay? Because some people say, well, when you have like six plus seven, this is the same as seven plus six. But they say that when we just have maybe like five minus three, we can switch, okay? We can switch. And they say, and they are right in, in, in a way, okay? Uh, they say that we can say that it is three minus five. We can switch them like that. Of course we can't because look, we just brought the three up in front, but we forgot to bring its signal. Of course not. That's why I'm, I'm telling you from the start. Okay, Let, let's just establish some rules in here, okay? The signal belongs to the number, okay? And this number has also a signal. If it's positive, we don't have to write it. Because if you think in this way, you can switch wherever you want. Now, let's take another example in here. Uh, minus five, the negative is always going to be green, okay? Minus five plus four. Can we switch? Yes, we can. Can we bring the four up in front? Yes, we can, but we have to bring the positive. And if the negative five is going into the, the back to the last position, we can we can drag the minus five to here, but you have to bring its uh, signal also, okay? This is going to be what? Let's bring the four to the front. It is the plus four which is going to the front, which is going to be just four. Remember, we don't write the positive when it, it begins our sentence in a way. And the negative five, it's coming right in here. Uh, and now let's let's even give another set of numbers. I'm only going to play in here with uh, switching places, okay? We can switch wherever we want to. Now, uh, let's take another example, maybe six plus eight. This is very easy. We can do this eight plus six. Well, let me tell you something. That plus that plus in here, it is this one, but it is invisible, why? Because we don't have to place it. And that plus in here, let me see if I had another 
Okay, I have one. And that invisible plus in here, okay, it is not a zero, okay? It is just uh, some notation I'm just writing here. It is going to be that plus, okay? Now, uh, let me write this equation in a different way. It's going to be easier. Now, let's do it like that. Well, it's going to be a plus six. I can write a plus, okay? It is not usual, but I can do it. There is nothing, nothing that forbids me from doing so. Plus eight. And this is going to be what? Let's switch places, okay? This is going to be an eight. There is no need to put the plus in here, but if I want to, I can. And that positive is going to be now in here, plus six. And it is the same, okay? Eight plus six, it is 14, right? We just make eight plus two plus four. So this is 14. And the reason I'm explaining all that, it is for you to understand that we have to think about this as a group and we have to think of this as a group. Can we switch? Can they switch places? Yes, they can, as long as you bring everything along, okay? Now, another example here, let's make like seven, N negative, what is, uh, the negative is green, right? So seven minus five. Can we bring the five up in front? Yes, we can, but you have to bring also the negative because they are one group, okay, one unit. Now, minus five. Now, the seven is a plus in here, isn't it? We don't have to write it, but it is a plus. Plus seven, okay? And it is the same. So we can switch places. What we can do, it is switch like here. This, we can do it, okay? We, we can just bring the three up in front, but forget its signal. The signal belongs to the number at its right location, okay? Now, let me see if there is anything. Let's just say some more examples. Well, now I'm going to start and I'm going to be quiet and you try to reason yourself. Like uh, maybe 12 minus eight. Well, if you switch, what's it going to be? You just think for yourself and after three seconds, I say it, okay? Okay, it's going to be negative 8 plus 12. Okay, you were supposed to say out loud, okay? You have to hear your voice. Sometimes it's important for us to hear whatever you're saying, okay? Uh, we understand even better. So when we just see people like talking by themselves, I am one of those. They're not crazy, okay? I'm not crazy. It means that sometimes it's good to hear our own voice because sometimes um, it sounds different when you just hear it, okay? Just like when we are uh, also uh, learning a new language, we have to hear our voice too uh, because uh, um, the, the mere fact of saying our brain is working away. The mere fact of listening, it is another source, okay? So, um, it's not crazy, okay? It's another way to see ourselves. Now, uh, let's make like um, one thing. Let's start with the negative. We didn't start. Maybe negative three plus six. How can we write this backwards? Well, we are going, okay, I'm going to stay shut and you just do it yourself, say it loud. I'm going to switch. The six must be in front. What should I do? Okay. Now we just have to write the six. I do have, do I have to write the positive and then negative three. Okay. No problems. So we can always switch the groups, not individually each number. Okay. We have to uh, see the signal as being part of that number okay so that's it for this second let's go to the third one